Your Excellency, thank you very much for granting us this interview here on the plains of Zambia. I'm told the tree behind us is Mongongo tree. That's what they say, yes. Yes. Thank you very much. I'd like to start off uh, the discussion with uh, public services. Um, when you came into office in 2008, the delivery, the service delivery, became one of your immediate priorities and you pronounced on this. I want to ask you, has your government measured or assessed the performance of the public service? And if so, how has this been done? Well, let me start off by saying that the reason why I put so much emphasis on delivery was specifically because at the end of the day, as the word would suggest, public service means exactly that. And the quality and the productivity of our services that we deliver as a government to the people of Botswana was how they would be able to benefit in their daily lives from those services. So the better we are at performing those services, then the better we are able then to look after our people. So we have set up a, a, a regime whereby we conduct reviews every six months of all ministries, their performance, and they report to me every six months, as I've said, in order to gauge how these services are being provided to the public. Okay. And, and obviously members of the public are, of course, the recipients of those services. Um, how do you gauge the public mood with respect to how they perceive these services? Any feedback? We indeed, we've, we've had um, uh, assessments done, um, both by ourselves and through Bokin, um, to see how they feel the, the, the public is benefiting from these services. So indeed we have got feedback and of course as you would expect in everything there are different opinions. Some would say for certain ministries um, the service is adequate, satisfactory, good, not so good and so it differs from ministry to ministry and it differs from department to department within a specific ministry. So for example you'll find um, the areas that we are trying to, to, one of the things that have been challenges is where we have people standing in queues for a long time waiting for services, whether it's for um, driver's licenses, um, getting passports, getting their omangs and what have you, going to the revenue offices. Um, in those sort of areas, um, whenever you have to wait in a queue, people don't want to be spending the whole day waiting in queues. So those are areas that we focus a lot of attention on as well. And I think over time we have been able to improve um, quite markedly uh, those services as well. But we've still got some way to go, but it's something which is evolving.